Matapos ang impresibong knockout na panalo ni Mark Magsayo sa Amerika, kung saan tatlong beses nito pinabagsak si Pablo Cruz. <coughs> Dahil nagustuhan ito ng mga kano, apat na buwan lang ang nakalipas ay agad pinabalik si Magsayo sa Amerika. Ngunit sa pagkakataong ito, ang ating Pinoy ay naitapat na sa pinakadelikadong boxer, ang former WBC World Super Bantamweight Champion na si Julius Seja. Ito ay malaking pagsubok kay Magsayo dahil ito ang kanyang pinakaunang nakalaban na dekalibreng world-class boxer. Lalo na alam naman natin na itong si Julio Seja ay nagmula sa pinakamatapang na bansa ng Mandirigma ang Mexico. Halika mga boxing fans, ating panoorin kung paano nakaligtas si Magsayo sa pagbagsak at brutal na binawian ang matigas na Mexican fighter. Sa laban na ito, dala ni Seja ang 32 na panalo at may 20 knockouts. Samantala si Magsayo naman ay may record na dalawamput dalawa na panalo at labing anim dito ay sa pamamagitan ng knockout. Isa ito sa importanteng laban ni Magsayo para maging contender sa WBC. Sa pagbungad ng unang round, naging malalakas na suntok na kaagad ang pinakawalan ng dalawang boxers. Mula sa mabilis na kaliwa ni Magsayo, bagsak si Seja, pero tumayo lang ito agad at lumaban. Tuloy ang action dito sa round 2 kung saan gustong makabawi ang Mexican boxer mula sa pagbagsak. Immediately 15 of 25 for a 60 percent, just 9 of 31 for a 20. So Maxayo has nearly doubled. Maxayo is very quick. He's got. That was for a vacant IBF belt in 118. So they end up Maxayo on the ropes. Where another player all landing a box. He shot punches now and lost very close. That's eight years ago. He's been through a lot. He'll fight right now. He'll come in when he has to. I know he's short. Tries the right hand lead. Now Maxayo is thrown it into another gear. Now there's a six gear. But that's I don't see this type of power. This weight class. Explosive and fast twitch. Is that a hundred and a big step up in class? Surround three. Bumawi na ang Mexicanong si Seja, kung saan inatake nito ang bodega ng ating Pinoy. Win a fight. He last captured the W back 2017. Mike Sayo on the opposite side that helped him get his knockdown. Back comes Sayo. Sayo hurt. So we'll see he's like this. We'll prune Mike Sayo. It's a linger shot, a trick. But uh, some guys really call it. I like how light she was and lets his hands go. Wow, that's impressive. I really like what Mike Sayo does. He's, he's really good. 
that he's physical. Let's see. I'll see how now with his chance. Plenty of time left in this round. Does it there too. Lands with a hook. Locked one shot. You know, he's really good at using his body. As, uh, as they always pay off later. You know, it's true. They will pay off later. Those body shots, like one fighter told me, because they're like. Sa round 4, tumatama ang mga counter ni Magsayo, ngunit mas agresibo pa rin ang Mexican boxer. He survived Magsayo's best punch, but he's coming forward. I want to know, guys, do you think... Hit with that same punch and it won't do anything, and then maybe the sound likes the chance that this is going to be a really match up an overhand right from Seham. But back comes Sayom. Sayom not looking to give up anything. to turn him down three times in the first round. Three a little bit. That's right. Fires back up a good fight so far. But Sayom showing the glass. Good delivery. Oh, not get clipped like that. Uh, like an all-round fight. Now, and if Seham keeps working that body, he got that opening, he let it fly. But again, Seham not a fight discrepancy, obviously. They're both hot. And picked up the head of Maxine. Maxine fires back into the side of the liver, which really does the damage. Put up a couple of lead taken, as the old saying goes. There's a lot of give and take. Let it go. What a spirit, this young man. Sa ikalimang round, tila ba hindi tinatablan itong Mexicanong si Cheja na patuloy pinunterya ang bodega ng ating Pinoy? Another Talagang nasaktan si Magsayo dito sa mga suntok sa bodega mula sa Mexican Warrior. Mula sa kombinasyon ni Seja, bagsak si Magsayo, tumayo man ito, ngunit bistadong nasaktan. Dito sa ikaanim na round, gusto ng tapusin ng Mexican boxer si Magsayo gamit ang mga suntok sa bodega. You uh, hurt your hand. How is it? Thank you so much for stopping by and taking time. We'll get back to the action. Here. Under Joe Goosen, the Mark Magsayo recover because his body looked forward to that November 6th. Number one in the world, Canelo Alley. Like what I see from Magsayo, considering... You find out what you are meaning that backed up Seha momentary. Team body shots in the round. Oh, tempo. And I believe there is a cut on the point of the sixth round. Left for Maxion. Seha pressing up here. You know, his round jump looked like a future world champ. Now he's getting busted up. So yeah, he landed here. Seha 19 body shots down. Good. Maxayo's number defensively. You know, he's, he's protecting himself. He finish up with that hook at the end of a three-punch three combination. Like a strike right glove up real high. Nice combination. That, that that's a foul. There's no quit in Maxayo. Woo! A sense. Now here's the fifth round. Look at that left hook. To the time ago now, Joe. That was the first round. That, that was let him down. So it started off with the right uppercut. Sa round seven, lamang na si Cheja sa mga patama Ngunit bumabato pa rin ang ating Pinoy. Larry, interesting, because you, you're going to say hot rounds, training, really good punches, and, and, and he, you know, I mean, on his way, if close, numerically. I say hot, just, if you're my side, use your jab, follow it with the right knee hot, and now I like the head movement as well, say on this. He's moving, using his angles from side to side to not allow Matsayo to have an easy... Nice. That is a 
exactly where Seha has to be to win this fight. Look at the body shot. Still a dangerous man. And this is a test of his will. Get yeah, his hands down. What with the right hand that starts somewhere in there? There was a nice grunt and he held on. That body shot upstairs right after this. Hey! Did not reacting well. Sa round 8, sigawan ang mga fans ni Seja na nag-abang sa pagbagsak ni Kabayan. Landed with the right hand and the back of my hand. He's fought some of the best. Good right hand. Isaiah, right here. Say how to look strong right now. This is he's working off eight years ago. Been through a lot. Disparity. Who do you And your speed to your advantage by the right hand. To try to deter Seha and make him expend energy. Seha, though, the fact that he's forced himself coming up shoot. On Max Hill. He'll be able to make that little strategy. Watch him there. Fighters looking. Sa round 9, unti-unti nang nakabawi si Magsayo mula sa mga atake ng Mexican boxer. In the fight, in the fifth round, should be cut down in round one off a hook. Julio Seha, basically. Angel the inside tie-up, box and move, try to score from off. They're putting him on the ropes and not letting him off the ropes. See how he backed it? Uh, well, you could be judging it that way, and I think Seha is pressure again. Does have, he's starting to show enough power to keep Seha quickly recovers after eating a big shot fight. With the middle pick. Round number 10 comes the number one contender. Power punches land. Uh, yeah, his toes now, Joe, getting yeah. out of danger. Let his hands go right up in Indianapolis and Detroit is 14. You know, got to win over very deep. Going off his strategy. And what a conceal on Fox. Jose Valenzuela. That's his nine and all. He's 24. Five, six punches. I don't know, back in the corner trying to jam his way out. Sa round 10, dito na ginulantang ni Magsayo ang Amerika na ikinalungkot ng mga Mexican fans. Now he comes right back to Seha. And now he, he might have Seha hurt. Banging over. Oh, jumps back in. And now it's a burn. Mula sa mabilis na kombinasyon ni Magsayo Bagsak ang Mexican na si Seya kung saan diretso ito tulog at muntikan ng matuloyan kaya sinugod na ito sa ospital. Nanalo si Magsayo sa pamamagitan ng knockout sa ikasampung round habang si Seya naman ay hindi na lumaban pang muli mula sa laban na ito. Sa inyo namang palagay, mag-champion kaya ulit si Magsayo dito sa Super Featherweight Division. Pag-usapan na lang natin yan sa baba at salamat sa inyong suporta. Lagi nang sundan, huwag magpapahuli. Pag-usapan ni Bakbakan, balita niya at laban. Mga Pinoy na di nagpapagapi. Salamat sa mga suporta na lagi nandyan.